I think one of the the really unique things that we have in terms of getting stuff that's important for the health of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people across the line is our structure. So the person who's the chair of our council now, or our faculty, um, also has a seat on the board of the college, uh, which allows a couple of things to occur. So if there's something that I think is really important, I can take that to the board, I can uh, represent um, our faculty on that board and explain to the rest of the board why this is important and we might get something across the line that might not have otherwise got across the line. But also, um, there are things that will happen in day-to-day -day running of such a large organisation like the college might go to the board that we think, oh, that really has no implication on Aboriginal people, but because there's an Aboriginal voice at that table, I can point out to the board members that this is something that's really important and we change the course of what we do around that.